Uh, okay, I'm gonna look down the other hallway as well. I'm guessing maybe that okay. one's a teleport room. Alright, you do that, and it looks identical to the other side. Okay. Alright, in that case, maybe I'll check out, check out the doors then. Okay. You check the door. You don't think it's trapped or locked. Okay, I'll just open it then. Okay. I'm guessing it's like a little bedroom or something. You do. You open it and it does indeed appear to be the barracks. Just bedrooms. There's not really beds. There's just like a blanket on the floor. But it doesn't really seem like people sleep in it. Perhaps they come into these rooms just to get away for a moment. But it doesn't really seem like it's mm. used. And like all of them, all of them are like that. Yeah. Because, yeah, just for completion's sake, I probably would go around and open all the doors and look into them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and there's nothing Just in case it was, like, interest. randomly one with somebody in it or something. Yeah. Okay. So, what do you do? Mm, They're checking know. it all. Yeah, we already did that. There's nothing here, so. I'm assuming we're gonna have to use some of these teleportation pads. Yeah, probably. But which way? Yes, which way? While lacking any other information, one way is as good as any other. <laughs> Unless yep. you wish to consult the quill. Oh, right. Already? I think we did at the beginning of the day. Uh, actually, you guys did... Yeah, I feel like we did. The... You, you did the day before, but you actually didn't do it today, because you guys did it at the tail end of your day before, because I kept asking you about it, and then you no, forgot wait, you know to I think use we it did. the next morning. We asked it about the first teleporter. Oh. Oh, that's right. You guys did stop and ask the quill, and then it told you in and out, basically. Yeah. Good. Good memory. Okay. Yeah, you guys used it. Alright, well, yeah, I mean, we can just choose one. Doesn't matter to me. Unless Abyssal it takes it. out a coin, oh, and he good. flips it. One, two, three is left. We'll go to the one we're closest to. I wouldn't like to die by getting dropped somewhere, so I'm going to put fly on myself. Okay. I'm holding a uh, Leopold, by the way. Okay. Uh, so blue was the one, right? Yeah. Yeah, I probably wouldn't have my air, mirror images or the invisib greater invisibility anymore. Although Airwalk's probably still on me. Yeah, blue is the one to go into to go somewhere. So I guess we do. Okay, one moment. <laughs> that mirror. All right, I'll be right back one second. Oh. Uh... Ah, uh, no wait, we're fifteen.
now I'm ready. Okay. All right, boys. I always Cheers. expect teleporters just to drop you into the middle of something nasty. <sighs> I cast mirror image on myself. I put fly on myself. This one's kind of fun because it's like you can go left, you can go right, and um, I don't know. One's worse than the other. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> My coin decided. Your coin decided. Okay, uh, Nizzo, is your how many images? Nizzo, are your images on? None. Or? Okay. That's what I'm saying. They're gone now. Your conceal's gone as well. Yeah, the the uh, greater invisibility only lasts for like a certain amount of rounds. Okay, sorry. I oh, hold on. Away, so Before we go, I need to said. drink these potions because I don't want to have damage on myself. Um, abysm. What's not on you? How many images do you have? I should have six plus myself. Okay, is the conceal still on you? And did you just put shield on you? Just now? Hmm. I'll probably use uh, it. The conceal should last 14 minutes from the beginning of that last fight, so I'm, I'm not sure how long we would have taken losing itself. my potion of cure moderate and serious. Okay. Uh, Amar, are you staying as air elemental? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'll do a potion of cure moderate as well. Um... Henrik, are your okay. mirror images still on? Or are you put new ones on? Um, they only last fifteen minutes. Do you think they would have been gone from our investigating all of the? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna say at least and... fifteen minutes passed for checking out stuff and investigating and stuffing them all. Okay, in your then I. Okay. Yeah, then I my will put shield new and my images blur on gone. myself. Okay. Here I go to roll for it. I'll just edit the one. I get one. the max amount. So you're at 1d9. Yeah. Uh, will the protections be off by now? No, they'll still stay on. Uh, those are 10 minutes for level. So your fly will be off though, right? No, I just put fly on myself. Oh, you just did that. Okay. Before we uh, step into the teleporter. I think combat tracker is clean. So you're good to go. All right, great. All right, you guys step onto the blue porter, and... I'm kind of jealous of that shield spell now, but it would have been really useful here. You'll find yourselves off to the left as I begin to move you over there. I guess I could have just selected all and took you all at once, but I like to make things complicated for myself. Yeah. So when you guys arrive here, it's not going to go unnoticed, so uh, allow me to... I think the giant alarm at the beginning pretty much negated any chance of <laughs> going around ignored, unnoticed. Well, I don't know. These guys are slightly easily distracted, but they're also rather perceptive, so... Hmm. That alarm we could hear through, like, 80 feet of stone. But it stopped and you went away for a little while again. Like, well, sort of. I mean... You stopped, but... Uh... We were jerking the alarms chain. Yeah... Um, this long chamber, um, you guys can't really see, like, the extent of it, so I'm not going to really give the full description until you guys do. But, um, when you guys do arrive here, you do see some more of those warriors with the great swords. Oh, boy. And one of them's actually, like, right next to the teleporter when you guys show up, and I'll... Reveal. Huh, hey, what's? Reveal her. <laughs> We're on break. Yeah. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> As she looks like she was like pacing around um, in thought, but when you guys showed up, um, she looked r up right at you guys, and uh, she says. Um, in Thessalonian, uh, the enemies are here.
You guys can roll initiatives. We don't have to be your enemies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Cause she's holding her uh, great sword up, uh, getting ready to attack at you guys. I'll bring it back to the bathroom. Did we have a resist fire? Um, last time you weren't in anybody's spell cast of it, so you didn't, but... Uh... Sure. Henry can always cast it. I mean, I could give it to you. I need a fire shield, I think. Yeah, you're Saren Wraithing, right? Yes, it has the advantage of having no SR, but it doesn't do the uh, resistance to fire like uh, the fire shield does. Yeah. Uh, is that everybody? One, two, three, four. Okay. Um, so before Nizza, you get to go, some individuals did beat you. But you guys can't see them, so you have no idea what's going on. But I need to take a moment to do what they do, so give me one second. Okay, Nizzo, um, it's your turn. What would you like to do? Um, hmm. Okay, I'm back. I think I'm going to use my Vanish ability to turn invisible for... Uh, one, or for five rounds here, so let's see here, that's vanish number two. And, uh, let's see, I can move 20 feet. Boop. I'm gonna move around the side, I think, for now. If he could close a door, he would have, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> see, so yeah, I turn invisible, that lasts for five rounds. Yeah, You're avoiding the other, uh, the, the red teleporter, though, right? Mm. Yeah, I'm not walking into it. I'm walking around the edge of it. Okay. <laughs> Just checking. I wouldn't want to send you somewhere random. Does it go somewhere random, or does it just go back? What if we just kept running from the red to the blue? Who knows? Or from the blue to the red? Just teleport through every single room. You guys haven't tried just it yet, peek. so... <laughs> well, we haven't tried it yet, so we don't know yet if the red one just goes back where we came from initially, or what happens. Like, it might just go... It might just be connected like that. Like, that would be that would be the logical way to do it, you would think. Alright, uh, you do see one at the far end of the room, um, and it begins to cast a spell. Let me double check, yeah. Henrik, you know this one. Indeed, I probably do. You know that she is casting Fireball. Wee. Wee. All right, reflexes, everybody. Including dear Leopold. Uh, Leopold's reflex should be higher than it is, I think. Uh, 
uh, what, what do familiars have? Nizzer, you need to read Do familiars this. have improved evasion by this level? I don't know. Well, I'll roll it anyway. Uh, where's the reflex? Oh, Leopold succeeds. He has evasion. He's a familiar. Okay, you guys all succeed. So only some of you are going to take half. Kaboom! A fireball explodes in the room you guys are in. Or they start with improved evasion. And then another one gets a turn, but you guys can't see it, so you don't know what it is doing. Henrik? Hmm. Well, in the interest of uh, saving charges on my wand, I'm going to do this, since I haven't done this in a while. Okay. I'm going to punch this person with my mind. Oh. Take this. Oh, I failed. Oh. <laughs> I missed. <laughs> missed with my brain. Uh, Diana's gonna move up and try to grapple number six. By biting at it. All I have to do is barrage you with fireballs until you cast something to counter that, and then... I don't know. I don't know after that. And, uh, that is exactly what, uh, Amar is gonna do. I figured. She was gonna do it last time, but Henry kind of did, but uh, I forgot what happened. I don't know. We got... She gets weird Where'd it go? Here it is. Hmm. Uh, sorry, Nizza. Oh, you don't get any? Can't see him. And not in my rain. I forgot to touch myself. Okay, that's our turn. Okay, um, some other individuals go. You can't see them. Number six is grappled, by the doing. way. As is Diana. Oh, uh, let me get to grapple on them. So, this one. I, uh... Am I getting grappled? Did I put grapple on you? No. No, you're not. No, you grappled Diana and uh, Warrior Six. No, with your mind. I am grappling everyone. Grappling Rampage. <laughs> All right, what you can do? Um, this is a weird room. Is this like a pillar that I'm standing beside? Um, I'll I'll go ahead and just give you guys the description of the room because at one point or another you're gonna bump into it. But uh, this long chamber is filled with two rows of wide work tables. The far end of the chamber contains three wide acloves. The ones to the north and south are each filled with all matters of alchemical supplies and large barrels, while the one in the middle contains a single huge vat of what appears to be twitching, foul-smelling flesh. Oh, we found the material reagent Ooh. for this place. <laughs> so these are tables, then? 
at a close. Um, contains three wide clothes. The ones to the north are filled with Okay. Um Okay, I guess I'll just move up here. Okay. I'll double move to here and took a look around. All right. So that's uh... double move for me. Yeah, and when you do that, uh, you you see things. Um, let me figure out which things you see here. You see this thing. You see... Okay, and number two and number five seem to have mirror images. So there are six okay. of each of them, as you can see. And number three, uh, there are five oh. of them. It's a pretty cool figure that you know that they're mirror images, but... Uh... I remember last time they spent like two rounds buffing themselves up, so they're probably doing the same yeah. thing here. Well, trying to. In the other room, they have the advantage of the sin spawn hoarding over you guys and giving them that time. But, uh, right. Not so much in this room. Uh, so number nine conveniently has a target. Uh, she's going to five foot step and cast a spell. Uh, you recognize this as Scorching Ray. Yep. And it looks like she hits you. Easily. And it's only one single ray. Okay. Uh, what resistance do you have? You have 30, okay. So. Okay, and then she recognizes that that didn't work out. Um, before it's other people's turns, it's gonna be... This one's gonna cast a spell. But you can't see it, so you don't know that. Oh, nice. Okay, uh, the one grappled is going to try to get out of the grapple. Uh, I didn't target Diana to 27, probably not do it. Uh, let me check. Mm. 
No. Okay. Round two. Warrior of Wrath number two has a target convenient, but she's going to do something else. She's going to cast a spell. Um, so, uh, Abysm, you can see her if you want to know what it is. Uh, you know that she is casting Bull's Strength on herself. Okay. And she's staying where she is. Uh, number five is also going to cast a spell. And this one... Hold on. This one is going to cast Haste. I guess you yeah, get to a craft, but with a plus 23, I'm pretty sure you'll know. <laughs> Once they start moving faster, it becomes kind of obvious. Yeah, you know that battle stance that just starts wobbling back and forth? Absolutely. Which will bring us to Nizzo. See what move like that, see what's around the corner. Mm, I'll have some food left after that. Let me see which one. Okay, this is. and then I'll hold on. Um you do see another one. Oh, well. I'm still invisible. But I'll uh I'll move up to five feet next, five feet from it, and if he doesn't move, then I'll just be able to five foot step full attack action him. Okay, I'm I'm gonna put him in. He's in a partial square, so. Um... Yeah, it's fine. I'm gonna put him in a whole square there. I'm gonna get them all in uh, a whole square here. Okay. Uh, is that your turn? Yeah, I had a double move to get there. Okay. Number seven, the fireball one, um, is going to cast another fireball. Henrik in Abysm, who can spellcraft anything at this point in time, will know that. <laughs> I don't even know why I ask for you guys to spellcraft anymore. These numbers are so high. Well, at least against these guys, it's like, no problem. Um, all right, so Henrik, Leopold, Amara, and Diana, go ahead and roll a reflex. This fireball? Yep. Yeah, probably. Okay. Uh, not abysm. <laughs> oh. I just get used to having to make them. I want to do it too. <laughs> All right, you guys all save, but Amara and Henrik will take half. Yeah, move out of the way, character sheet. There we go. And you resist all of it. And she's like, dang it, it's not working anymore. Okay. Yeah.
Um, I really wish uh, I had echolocation prepared for today, because it would be really useful. Well, I'm sorry I'm not you. Henrik? Oh man, there's so many of these guys. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Well, my best thing against people who are making themselves difficult to hit physically is to hit them with unerring magic missiles. <laughs> okay. Which one? Uh, let's see. Let's just go down the list. Uh, how about number six here? That's crap. <laughs> Down the list. Yep. That's my turn. Do you guys like the. Uh, let's better? try to maintain the grapple. For health indicator. What was that? Do you guys like the dot better for the health indicator? That's fine. I, I don't mind it. Okay, grapple succeeds. I just keep forgetting which ones are unconscious because I don't have There's like, a the visual. bite damage, and here's the rake. Okay, they hit. Okay, that one's dead. She'll drop him. Okay. Uh... Here, this is what I'll do. I'll just make an effect. There. Can't miss it. I'll go see what's around the corner. Okay. Surprise! Stuff. Many of them. Lots of images of them. Is that it? Does Amara do anything? As, or is that a dog? Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm doing something. Okay. I can never tell with you sometimes. Oh, Nizza, I'll reveal the rest of the you see further down, of course. I'm going to, as a standard action, summon a nature's ally, uh, fourth level spell. Let's see, which spell do I want to burn? Uh, let's burn this one. And let's uh, let's put it here. Okay, what are you summoning? Uh, tiger. Uh, I 
think we already have a tiger for you, don't we? Just a regular tiger, right? Just a regular tiger. Okay, there's your tiger. And this tiger is gonna try to maul something. And it needs to roll a d6. There's an image. Okay. And the D5. Which one is it attacking on? Uh, number five? Uh, number five. Okay. There goes another image. Grr, Leopold's getting violent. Okay, that's my turn. Okay. Uh, number three will cast a spell. Okay, so she's going to cast a spell. I'm sure a bosom will spellcraft it, as well as recognize bull's strength. Um, she is going to five foot step. Okay, uh, a bosom. Okay, uh, Warrior of Wrath number three here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to five foot step forward. Uh, she has images up, right? Yes, there's five of these warriors. Okay, so I am going to full attack. Uh, the first spell I'm, or the spell I'm casting as part of this is going to be dispel magic targeting the mirror images. Okay. Bah. Is she an eighth level caster? <laughs> um. So it's 11 plus their caster level, so you dispel, and are we dispelling the lowest level? What are we doing? I'm, I'm specifically the targeting mirror the mirror image. The mirror image? Okay. You succeed at dispelling the mirror image on number three. Oh. Okay. Uh, then I will continue with my attack. Yeah, they're pretty low level. <laughs> it's supposed to be overwhelming because they're plentiful, but you guys are level 15 heroes, you know, so yeah, yep. not a lot's going to stop you. You didn't target? I did. You are self-targeted too, though. That's weird. Okay, I don't know why that was. I don't know either. Um, okay, but I'm... since it looks like I'm broken again... <laughs> I don't know why that happens. It's so weird. Um, okay, let me check and see what we got going on here. Because that's number three. She does have the haste on us. So... Yeah. The 20 hits, the 32 hits, the 14 does not hit... The 33 does not 
or does confirm, the nine does not confirm. So it looks like one crit and one hit. Okay, so one hit. And then one crit. And I forgot to juice up my sword with anything, so that will be it. That's fine. I was not forgetting, just not doing it, so no, no change there. Looks like I was playing Abysm somewhat okay. <laughs> it says I am targeting her. Yeah, you were targeting you and her, and it didn't even hit yourself okay. either, so it's... I don't know why you keep detaching well, and breaking. I'll try to research that, because it is kind of starting to get a little frustrating, I guess. I'll just restart, uh, because my turn is now done. Okay. Yeah, I shouldn't have to, though. <sighs> Dear Fantasy Grounds, I have a letter for you. Um, number nine, where is this one at? Over here, okay, this one did a ray earlier. Um, this one is going to cast a spell-like ability. Uh, let me just read an insert really quick here. This is so bad, there's no reason to do this. But um, yeah, she's gonna cast a spell, number nine. Um, and it's gonna be directed towards Star Fox. Or not Star Fox, um, the, the uh, Amara. She doesn't know. So, this ray comes flying at Amara, but it don't matter because Amara's probably going to resist it all. As she begins to learn, and she's going to five foot step back as well. It doesn't matter if she five foots or not, but. Number four does not know. There is a Nizzo there. Uh, this number four begins casting a spell. Nizzo. I don't think you can spell craft, can you? <laughs> so I guess technically you don't know what it is then. And she stays where she is. Uh, round three. Number two? Where's number two at? Number two has a tiger in front of her. How exciting. Uh, number two is going to full round the tiger. Oh, the tiger also gained some temporary hit points, I'm pretty sure. Well, confirm that, because I might kill it. Uh, 
Alright. First swing hits, and the haste swing will also hit. Uh, gains temporary hit points equal to her druid level. Okay, so 15. Yeah. I'll just soak that up next time. Number five versus number five. Number five also has a tiger in front of her. How how exciting. Um, she's going to do the same thing. She's going to swing the great sword twice at the tiger. I did not target because I suck at this game. Um, the tiger's AC is only 14. Okay, so both will hit. Wait, what? Why is it not soaking the... Uh... Oh, I put that on Diana. Whoops. Okay, so the tiger is still alive. Which brings us to Nizzo. Doesn't look like she noticed you at all. Yeah, I'm gonna five foot step and try to take her out. <laughs> okay. Might hit an image, I don't know. I guess I could I could do the, the hacky trick where you just close your eyes and be like, I'm fighting them blind, but no, I'm not gonna do mm. that. I'm just gonna hope I hit. And then I try to dispel it. <laughs> I don't even know if I have blind fight. Like that might not be a it might be like a really terrible idea anyway if I don't have blind fight. Um anyway. Uh we'll start the first attack here. Looks like it hit. I actually forgot to hit the flat footed button too, so <laughs> um, but I gotta roll a d5, it looks like, yeah. Let me find this stupid custom dice thing. I guess it's gonna be, where the heck is it in? I don't see a d5 on here. I'll just roll it manually, I guess. Yep. D5s and 7s, you have to roll manually. And 9. 5, 7, and 9. I guess I hit an image. That's unfortunate. Because now I'm not going to hardly do anything to her because I'm uh, <laughs> no longer invisible. My other attacks aren't going to have sneak attack. I really needed it. And, oh, well, anyway, I'm just going to, for now, I'm just going to work on the images anyway. Okay. Um, but that would have also been nice because it would have broke her thing. Or could have broke the, completely got rid of the mirror images just doing that by dispelling them. Uh, so it's a d4. I guess uh, that one I should be able to do. I don't. I don't see it. Your Wait, duh, D4. <laughs> I was thinking I needed a custom dice for it. That's uh, Alright, so yeah, I hit an image. And then I'll go for one more attack. And then that one's actually uh, using the custom dice button. D3. Broke another image. Cool. It's down to one image. <laughs> Uh, and that was a full full round action, so. Okay. Um, number seven. That's the fireball one. And it wasn't working out for her. She's going to cast a spell. As she puts 
displacement on her as she seems to be slightly out of place. And this one is rounds per level, so I have to mark it. Um, can't see this one all that well, but it's going to cast a spell. Guys, I'll know what it is when you see her. Henry? Alright, it's my turn. Yeah. They're buffing. Alright. Hmm. Can I get sight on any of them? Hmm. Yes, I can. Move 30 feet and then one. And that's my turn. Okay. Uh, Diana and Damara. Mantis there. Oh, sorry. Um, let's say, uh, let's go over here. No. Uh, let's go this way. To attack. Uh, oh, Henrik moves there. Wonderful. Yep. Um, to attack number five. Okay. There are four of these warriors. Okay. There goes an image. Uh, Tiger will do the same thing. Auto miss. Would a plus two because of flank affect that at all? No. No, okay. Well, rip tiger. <laughs> Let them kill one thing. <laughs> the cat won't keep playing if you don't let it have something. And Diana's going to try to bite this guy. Uh, does this guy have anything? Um, Doesn't look like it. Number three? Okay. Here's the damage. And let's grapple. Okay. Uh, 
Now, all right. Uh, number three. And before when these guys kill something, they get a super boon or something silly. Morale bonus. Number three is going to... Defensively cast a spell. And she succeeds. And Bism's probably the bigger threat, aren't you? I'm not a threat. I just wanted to talk. <laughs> but I think you're the one that did the most damage. Could be wrong. I don't know. Uh, do you spellcraft it? You'll auto succeed. You might also recognize this spell as Shocking Grasp. Okay. Since there's nothing much I can do about it. Eh. She hits. Oh. Uh, does... Oh, dang it. I hate it when does. Images. That. Yeah. My thing, though, like, I hate combat mode because, like, when you accidentally spend it, it goes away, you know? So. Yeah. <laughs> Standard mode's totally better. Okay. How many are there of abysms? I'll scroll up, scroll down. Where are you? D7. Okay. Uh, she unfortunately takes out an image. Does that mean she still has the grass? Shocking grass? Or does that go away? I don't uh, as long as she doesn't it. cast a spell, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't discharge it. Okay. Cool. Okay, uh, then that would be her turn, and it is your turn. Okay, I will, um, I guess just straight up attack. This should work. Okay, you do not confirm a crit. So, if I'm reading this right, I hit three times and crit once, or hit yeah. twice and crit once. You okay? You hit, you hit, and you hit. Then you crit and you not crit. So you hit all three times, okay. but only one of them's a crit. Ah, uh, looks like I only needed to hit once. Well, you hit him a bunch more times, so uh, he's probably very dead. Go ahead and do the other damage, just because. There we go. Number nine, number nine. Okay. Uh, number nine will cast a spell.
And she appears to look stronger. <laughs> Number one's just getting whatever she wants. Okay, number four. That's the one next to Nizza, right? Um, she doesn't know any different, so she begins to cast a spell. Wait, did uh... you? No, you didn't. You missed her. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ah, there's Nizza's four. Do I just you... broke a bunch of her images. Yeah, do you... Um... Yeah, and she's not sure how that happened, obviously. Um, well, no, she can see me. I just used Vanish. Oh, I thought you were... I'm not invisible anymore. Still... I'm just standing right in front of her. Okay, then she does see you. Okay. Yeah, it's just Vanish wasn't greater invisibility this time. Yeah, and then she's not going to cast a spell. She's going to turn and attack you. Okay, I'm going to use my sense motive thing, so... Okay. If I beat the sense her sense motive or the her attack roll sense motive, I get an AC bonus. Okay, it's gonna be a. That's a really low roll. Thing. Every time I fucking have used this ability, it's been awful because <laughs> I always mm. roll fucking two on it. That's alright. Eventually it'll work out. Missed anyway, but I don't get the AC bonus. Oh well. Oh well. I get to try again next turn if she's still alive, which she probably will be because I can't do sneak attack damage to her. <laughs> Uh, this, this one's dead. Does she only get one attack? Wow. Yeah, they need the haste for the second attack. Um, number two. Number two's gonna take a swing at the tiger. Hit. Tiger's probably dead. Tiger's poofs away. Then Tiger disappears. She's going to uh, move over here. Uh, number five. Yeah, she, she's doing all right. Um. She's going to five foot step in and full round you tomorrow with a haste attack. Oh, not working out for her. Nizza? All right. Um, maybe these guys, I can at least break the image on it, I guess. I'm not, it's not going to be very useful because I can't get a flank with anybody here. It's really hoping to like get that first attack, but stupid mirror images. Um, okay, it's a hit. Oh, I wrote the wrong. Whatever, that's the same two hit, so yeah. I'm going to do the no sneak attacks. Do a little bit of damage. Um, oh, actually, shit, no, sorry, I need to do the... Uh, I forgot, I need to do the D2 yes. versus concealment. Okay, there goes an image. So actually, I just break an image. Um, but the image is gone, so if I hit the next hit, we'll just use that damage on this one, if that's fine. Okay. Okay, so there we go. I already rolled the damage for that one, because I rolled it on the wrong one on accident. And then I'll do one more attack. And do a little bit more damage. Okay, I'm... Chipping away at him. I guess I, I can 1v1 these guys no problem, even without sneak attack. <laughs> yeah. Probably. And uh, I don't want a 5 foot step here. Maybe. I think I'll 5 foot step. Just so that maybe I can move on to actually go over and start flanking on one of these other targets. Okay. Depending on how the landscape shaves out. Anyway, that's it for my turn. Uh, 
number seven. Number seven's gonna cast a spell. As three missiles fly at Amara. Stop that. And then she's going to move behind the wall. She's just like the only one that's done damage. Watch out for her. Lucky seven. Where is number seven? She moved. Now you can't see her. She was down here. So the missiles came from down there. Mm. But yeah, she moved out of the way. Uh, where are we at? Eight. Good old eight. Good, 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 good number eight. I, I think she's ready to come out of the shadows. She's all, she's, she's got her buffs, man. Or does she? Can I do more? I can. Uh, Nizzo, you lose sight of eight. She, she leaves your sight. Eight. That's the one at the very bottom. Yeah. She she walked okay. off to the left behind that stuff there. So I see her leave vision, but not poof into invisibility or something. Okay. Right. Okay, so that brings us to Henrik. Okay, so... Oh boy, which one next? I do wish I had something a little more oomph now. Just to clear these guys out fast. <laughs> so many of them. There are so many of them. I'm gonna magic missile this one. Okay. That's my turn. And she's still up. Okay. Charge! Charge and slightly crooked charge, but yeah, charge. Okay. Number nine. Are there no images on this one? I don't see any images no on this images. one. She started with Scorching Ray, learned her lesson. She regrets not having images, though. And grapple. Okay. Yeah, I got him. So we're both grappled, uh... I guess I'll smack this thing. Oh, there's a potential crit. Uh... Roll d3! Yeah. <laughs> No crit for it, yo! Oops, that should be a d2. Uh, 
No. Oh, okay, images are gone. Henrik, punch him. But I'm, but I'm wanding. <laughs> I'm wanding as hard as I can. Okay. Stab with the wand. I believe until in you, I Henrik. The, until I get the feat that allows me to dual wield magic missile wands, you're just gonna get five at a time. Wait, you can dual wield magic missile wands? If I try hard enough. <laughs> It's not really a feat, but you know what? I do it enough that it should be a thing. <laughs> Abysm. Oh, Henrik's pride and greed and God knows what else is sometimes overwhelming. A double move up here. Okay. Uh... Okay. See, you're gonna. Yeah, okay. There you go. <laughs> My turn. Double move. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, there's other things you can do, but okay. All right. Um, this one is grappled. We know that getting out of grapple is pretty hard. But I wonder if casting is easier. No, probably not. No escape artist either. She gonna try to get out of the grapple. Am I rolling the correct one? Did a 22 get past Diana's CMD? Probably not. Is that giving me the bonus? It is. Okay. Um, stuck in a grapple. Number one. Ah, uh, yes, number one. Okay. So, there's one you guys haven't seen this whole time. It's quite fabulous. Okay. Number four is the one at Nizzo. Uh, it's going to swing the great sword at Unizo, despite Abyssum showing up. Okay, right, I'm gonna use my my thing again. Oh. Oh, it didn't matter. He missed anyway. But I'm still gonna use my thing again because okay. reasons. Reasons. Yeah, for one minute I have a plus two AC bonus versus him, okay. or whatever. <laughs> um, she. I just want to roll the dice. She's gonna five foot step also over here. It's not very nice. Okay. Yeah. It's mm. fine. We have ways to handle this. <laughs> Round five, number two. Is feeling a little confident. She's gonna move forward and, you know, she's gonna charge. She's gonna charge Diana. I mean, they do have numbers, I guess. This cat is kind of a problem. Charge and miss. It's just not going so good for her. Number five, still alive. Um, number five is going to take two attacks at Amara. You don't know. Hmm. Number five is going to defensively cast a spell. And I'm not thinking anybody's spell crafting. Uh, 
looks like she lost all her images already, but um, she puts displacement on herself. Oops, I didn't mean to double click, but I just wanted to check and see if she succeeded to defensively cast, and she did. And now it is Nizzo's turn. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to screw up the initiative order. And by that I mean, uh, let's see, I'm going to do an acrobatics roll to try to, uh, like, move around her. So if I don't beat her CMD, she gets an attack opportunity against me, but I'm going around her, so she's still, I still gotta, oh shit, I can't quite do that, can I? I have to go th try to go through her square, which would be, I have to beat the acrobat, beat CMD by five. So if I beat the CMD by five, this will work. Okay, um, her CMD plus your five, you get three. I rolled really shitty, like normal. You get through. Did I beat it by five? Yep. Oh. Okay, cool. Well, yeah, with the... Yeah. Yes. Okay, cool. Fortunately, their CMD is not very high. <laughs> not really. So I move over to the other side, and then I'll do a ready to action so that as soon as Abyssal moves into flank, I'll attack. Okay. So nothing happens yet. Can you move and ready an action then? Yeah, ready to action is just a standard yes. action. Okay. Uh, number seven. Right, this one. Um, I guess you guys can't see number seven right now, so you have no idea what number seven is doing. So yeah, when my ready to action triggers, I'll just put my initiative at the same time as... On the same turn as Abysm. Unless, of course, Abysm doesn't move up to flank. Like, he's just like, I leave now. No, no, no. I got you. <laughs> I need Leopold to come over and flank for me. I don't think he actually can, but I mean... Yeah. I want him to try to flank. <laughs> I don't think he threatens enough squares to flank with anyone. If he got enlarged animal cast on him, he would be good. <laughs> there we go. I need a wand of enlarge animal. I'll just cast it on Leopold and be like, get over here, Leopold. Here, be my flanking partner. Hold on one more second. The problem is with that is he'd probably get attacked then. Okay, Henry, it's your turn. Alright, well, since uh, Mara requested it, I will wand the one that the cat has grappled to finish it up. Okay. I did? That's the one you were talking about, right? Huh? Uh, no, I had to punch the one that I removed the mirror images from that now has displacement up. Oh, alright. Not, I didn't care about, uh, you can do whatever you want. That's that damage. Yeah, that's pretty low. Okay. Uh... Diana is not going to maintain the grapple. There's number nine down at the bottom. Okay, she drops it. Uh, full round. I'm going to start with one claw to this guy. Oops, that's the wrong one, but still. It's not the same rolls, but anyway, it's a one. Okay. So, uh, roll number two. That's a hit. Okay, and the last attack is at number two. And let's see through the d6 if she hits. She does! <laughs> And she's going to grapple this guy. Okay. Uh, 
and she hits. Aha! No casting or using your greatsword for you, and uh, I'll attack the guy through the displacement. You hit. And you miss. Uh, dead. That's very helpful. Abysm? Okay, I five foot. Alright, triggers my, my ready to action. Step down! So, uh, let me do that real fast. Alright, so Nizzo is um, now... Wait, what number is Abysm? Nine? Okay. Let me hit the flank button. Plus two flank button. And... Like that hits. Yep. We'll roll the damage first. That uh, is impressive. One, 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 Ooh. one, one. <laughs> yeah. Does she have any uh, spells up? So I'll dispel those as well. Um. What number is this? Uh, four. Okay. Um... I roll a spell check with my caster level, so I'll just do that yeah. real fast. And then the DC is 15 plus the caster level of whatever spell effect she has she on her. So I'm trying does... to remove whatever the lowest spell effect she has. You do not succeed this time, though. Okay. Uh, also, I lower her AC by 2, so that will make it easier Wait. for Abysm to hit her. Yes, you do. It's 11 plus their caster level, so you do succeed at removing the bull's strength. Yay! <laughs> now she's even more useless. <laughs> Alright, right, Abysm, you get a, you'll have an easier time hitting her now, too, because I uh, broke her defenses for you a little bit. Um... That was my fault. I didn't target her that time. Okay. <laughs> I'm just starting that to probably accept hits, it though. now, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they both hit. That probably okay. Okay. That was a crit confirm. No. Oh wait. Oh, that was just two attacks. Or, uh, I don't know. No, it was a crit you confirm, did roll a sixteen, like. so I think you have an option for. Oh, that is the confirm. Gotcha. Then it was. That yeah, was the yeah confirm. yeah. Okay. Okay, that was one attack. Now that everything's lined up properly. And you miss. Blah. I got Is that one with more. the minus two AC from my sneak attack earlier? Um, for her number four, she doesn't really have any defenses left. So yes, that would hit the seventeen, uh, not the eleven. <laughs> so the seventeen hit though because of the lower That's AC. Seven. Yes. Okay. I had a feeling it was kind of borderline there. I was like, it's probably yeah. she's probably really close. So yeah, their AC. Ah. Uh. But, you know. <laughs> she survived. Somehow. <laughs> Somehow. That's actually pretty amazing. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Alright. Uh, that brings us to unconscious number nine. And, ooh, number one. Hey, guess so what, So we get guys? for not trying to, use, trying to not use resources on these guys. They're like, nah, they're really weak. Just All auto right. attacks. <laughs> That's exactly why I, I, I'm moving up, is because without juicing myself up, I don't do a lot of damage, so I'm trying to help Nizzo dish out all the damage without using resources. <laughs> yeah. Alright, number one comes around the corner and casts a spell. Because I'm sure there's something in here that's going to be like a pain in the ass to fight. It's It's not these guys, but... I mean, they're kind of a pain in the ass, but <laughs> more in the sense like, God damn it, this fucking fight's still going. Henrik, you'll recognize this as three missiles come flying at your face. I need to get like a way to get myself true sight. That's that's one of the ways to counter mirror images. <laughs> Just be like, screw that, true sight. Number four. Still alive. How? All right, uh, can number four do? 
Number four is going to defensively cast a spell. And succeed. Um, as she seems to be slightly displaced now. Oh man, her initiative's pretty bad, isn't it? Okay. Uh, and she'll five foot step here. This one's dead. Number two is grappled. I don't really like that. That sucks. Um, number two, number two, number two. She's gonna try to get out of it. Uh, she does not. Number five, fighting Amara, hasted. Uh, she's gonna take two. S no, she's she was having a hard time, wasn't she? Uh, she's gonna full withdraw. Number seven. Ah, yes, number seven. You guys aren't sure what number seven is doing because you can't see her. Okay, number eight. Well, I do have blind fight. I look at it again. You should close your eyes versus these things. When they have mirror images of it, it might not be like the number worst eight's idea. gonna come around the corner and send. Mm. Missiles at Abysm. Now, actually, the ultimate question is, is, is the shield visible? Like, is its spell effect visible? Like, obvious? I think it says it's an question. invisible shield. I'll check the description. Because if it's pretty visible, she's not going to make that decision. Then again, I guess I do that spell craft. Yeah, okay. Um... It does say it creates an invisible shield of force. Okay, but she did a, a knowledge and she knows, she sees spells in place. Um, I, uh, I cast this before we came through the teleport. But they still can. Which how does that work? You guys have done it to me as a game master. I'm gonna think about that later. But um, anyways, I'm fine. I'm fine. That's okay. I just don't think she's gonna send them at you because you've already like. Well, no, you haven't resisted any missiles. But um, anyways. She's sending missiles at Nizzo. Nizzo, uh, three missiles are coming flying at you from across the room. She saw you come in earlier and strike at her ally earlier, so you it is. Okay. Okay. Uh, I am going to magic missile the one that uh is trying to get away. <laughs> you not getting away. Hopefully this time I won't have minimum effect. Okay. 
So that last match of Missile Barrage was pretty weak. <laughs> yeah. Oh, never mind. That was mage armor. Whoops. Didn't mean to give him mage armor. <laughs> what number was that? Five? Magic miss. Oh. Uh... Alright, there we go. It's my turn. Okay. And Diana and Damara? She's gonna try to maintain the grapple. Okay. And so here's the bite damage for maintaining the grapple. And she'll s rake. Okay, now this is like one of those tricky things because I don't think just because you have it grappled, I don't think that means you get to skip the mirror images. I'll roll the mirror images. Yeah, I was just thinking about that a moment ago. I was like, I'm not really sure, but I don't think you get to. Okay, so one image down. Two images down. And Amara will go over here and smack number... Actually, she doesn't need to go that far. She'll go over here and smack number five. Okay. Ah, oh, she misses. Oh, she misses. And let's see, number three is dead. Uh, Nizza. Um, I don't think I'm going to do the flanking thing again this time just because, uh, like, I mean, I still set up so Bism can flank, but I'm not going to wait, do this prepared action because I think I'm, she's really low. I probably just need to land a hit and displacements in the way. Okay. So I think I'm better off doing a full attack action in this case. I guess I could have also just delayed my initiative, but eh, whatever. Um, you hit. Looks like I hit. Ah, she's dying. There we go. Yeah, I was right. <laughs> um, and that's all I can do because it was a five foot step. So I don't really have anything I can do with a move action. Did you have a second attack, or no? Uh, well, she's dying. You can finish <laughs> I'm not going to continue attacking her. Okay. No, there's no reason to. Alright, it is I know we're it's in the Halls of Wrath, but... I'm, okay. I'm... Nizzo's yeah. not wrath <laughs> Not usually. A number of you probably feel uncomfortable actually being in this hall, you know, because none of you really are wrathful. Maybe Leopold is. I don't know. Maybe, <laughs> Maybe Leopold doesn't feel uncomfortable. <laughs> no, he Leopold feels perfectly comfortable because of how wrathful he is. <laughs> what has Leopold done when I've been away? <laughs> we don't know. That's the, uh, that's the mystery things. of it all. Who knows? Terrible what things, doing. okay. <laughs> Leopold's never with the party. Most of us could don't be even doing know. Stuff. <laughs> I charge this this one down here. Alright. Yeah, Kepri probably would have felt pretty good here, but then again it's a different campaign, so I don't know how she would have her emotions would have been different, perhaps. Who knows? Oh, miss. Okay, oh, I'm done. Yeah, you missed. You didn't want to coup de gras? Or number five? Oh, for sure. 
What the heck? Yeah, pretty sure you're oh, wearing he a okay. charge there or something. Gotcha. All right, number I nine. Don't, I don't usually attack down to people. Number one. Oh, here it is. I'm not even sure I need this. She's gonna charge at you, Henrik. Oh shit. This is I where Henrik pulls though. out a scroll blade. This is this is what I've been waiting my... for this whole combat. A shot at Henrik other than magic missiles. No, I'm kidding. Wizard battle. Wizard battle. <laughs> Okay. Are you just using the invisibility for like the displacement effect? Or is she actually invisible? It's just for, for the, the displacement. displacement. Yeah. You can see her. Oh, okay. There's seven of her and she's slightly out of place. I think I have a better chance of hitting this thing if I just close my eyes and walk up to it. I need to look up a spell really quick, because... Uh, one, it didn't go off, and two, I need to see whether or not it has to. Um... I probably have to leave after this combat, by the way. Okay. No. Maybe even before the combat ends, oh, if okay. it drags too much. But Either way, if that happens, you can, it you can hit, see me. but um, yeah. this thing's going to go away now. Mirror images. Oh, you have mirror images? Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, yep. How many? How many? Nine. Eight of oh, them. God, okay. <laughs> D9. Okay, take out an image. Go ahead and return 18 health to yourself. Okay. Alright, now you got a sword in your face. I do have a sword in my face now. Yes. It's quite uh, annoying. Yeah. <laughs> Good for her. Uh, round seven, number two is grapple. Um... So to cast a spell, it's 10 plus their CMB plus double the spell level? Is that right? Well, grapple? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Alright. Yeah, actually, it might be like 15, I'm not sure. What's Diana's CMB? Uh, what? Uh, 32? Oh, CMB. Yeah, CMB, no. uh... CMB is 21. Oh, yeah, I don't, I don't really foresee her doing this, but she's gonna try anyway. She's gonna try to... Okay, I keep clicking twice every time I do that, but she fails. She tried to cast a spell, but it just it's not working out for her, so she's gonna have to think of something else if she wants to live. Uh, number five. Hey, number five conveniently has abysm in front of her, but that's not exactly what she wanted. She was fleeing for a reason. Um, she's going to continue to do so. She's going to full withdraw away. Um, and Amara, that will provoke from one of the squares, but it will be uh, with a minus two cover because it's that square there. So if you want to take that attack of opportunity. You miss it, okay. Number seven. Uh, 
Number seven's going to come in. She's hasted. She moves fast. She's going to cast a spell. Actually, she's probably going to cast a spell before she moves in, so you guys aren't going to know, but it's going to be kind of obvious when, like, multiples of her show up uh, as she's mm -hmm. putting mirror image on herself. But she is coming into the scene. And there are five of her. Number eight... Ah, number eight. Hey, Abysm, how's it going? Somebody might get you this time. What's up? She might, she might get you. I might get you. It's a debate, though. She's going to charge, which is going to provoke from Amara. Um, you don't have to take that penalty cover because it's going to be the square that uh, isn't covered. Don't forget, he has mirror images. Because everybody in this fight has mirror images. Yes, everybody has mirror images. I haven't put mine up actually this fight yet, but. Yeah. Um, so this is supposed to work, and I'm not even sure if it's gonna because the way the stupid system didn't work before. So I'm just gonna. I'm gonna, um. Diana and Amara don't have mirror images. I'm just gonna push this button. Did it do it? What did? It did it! Does a 52 hit you, Abysm? Oh my god. Uh, no. <laughs> a 52? Did she like true strike? She probably true strike. She true striked, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Uh, no. <laughs> um, so the, you take 12 damage. Nothing extraordinary, but... I have uh, some mirror images up. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. We just talked about that, too. I'm going to roll this. Remember, everybody has mirror images. Um, a three. Go ahead and return 12. Well, oh, back to yourself. Plus, even if it had is this where like, secrets like I'm going to choose the most aggravating part of my party is kits and have a bunch of lowish level characters just spam the most aggravating spells no if I got to rework this whole entire hall of wrath I would because it's pretty crummy it's su supposedly you know supposed to be the hardest one because it's the last one you go through but it's really not um it's just, uh, I guess, tedious because you have to deal with all the displacement and mirror images, you know, so uh, maybe resource consuming, I guess, perhaps. Um, Potentially. But yeah. <laughs> that's but... why we're at this, like, Abysm and I, for example, just like, eh, auto attack everything. Yeah. Don't even use, don't even use any spells. <laughs> as soon as I saw how fast they were actually dropping, because I... The player Mantis hadn't encountered them until this session. I was like, oh, why did I even summon anything? This is only our second fight with them, though. The other yeah. one was the first fight, so. You guys were just not starting. Not as really new yet. Yeah. Yeah, not as really new yet. Okay, Henry? All right. Got to deal with these guys near me. Yeah. The swarm has come out completely. Yeah, they're they're pretty annoying. Do I but do I want to kill them? That's that's the that's the question. I don't know. We didn't kill the other ones in the other room. Did we? Did we not? I thought we did. I thought we kind of did. We killed some of them, but some of them we just left stabilized. After we took all their stuff. 
Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Hmm. Well, I'm gonna take a five step back. I'm gonna start casting a spell. Um, okay. Give me one second. Let's see. Go for it. And I am going to cast oh, I wish they were like lined up for a lightning bolt. <laughs> unfortunately, they are not. I learned my lesson not to do that. <laughs> I'm gonna give him one of these some different evocation Fight evocation with evocation. This big old like just sheet of like sleet and hail and ice shoots out of uh, Henrik's uh, hand, and he says, "I think you two need to chill out." <laughs> and they both fail. Oh. All right. And that's his turn. Okay. Uh, Diana and Damara. Uh, maintain grapple. Okay, she does. Critically wounded. Uh, how many of these images do we have? Four. Still a bunch. Okay, one image down. Two images down. Um, and Amara will attack the thing that... Uh, yeah, whatever, I'm not going to do the gimmicky thing. Let's full attack this thing. One hit. Uh, so we have to do five. Okay. That's our turn. Hey, I had a really fast turn. <laughs> Hooray. I'm proud of you. Wait, what? Why did I click that button? I don't know. All my wands disappeared again. What the fuck do I have to do to get them to come back? Oh, it's Standard mode, Standard or preparation, yeah. Mm, there we go, okay. Uh, where are we at? Okay. Um, this guy's dead. Uh, Nizu. Um, I think I'm gonna do something fun. I'm gonna turn invisible vanish again. Okay. Uh, so that'll be my third use of that. And I'm gonna, like, five foot step, and I'm gonna use a move action to pull out my wand of acid splash. I'm gonna do some acid splash sneak attacks. It's gonna be good fun for everybody. Asses, but if you can yeah. hit them, they still have mirror image. Yeah, I know that's true. Okay, uh, abysm. Okay, I am going to as a swift action, I use spell recall. Okay. Get, to get back to Dispel Magic, which I will then cast to get rid of the displacement on this person. Okay, so you're going to target displacement. 
Yes. And then I'll just finish up with my attacks against the... Oh, unless your caster level's 5? Nope, you don't do it. <laughs> oh, okay. So here we go. Sad day. Oh, wow. I forgot to check this off. Mud broke again. Uh, um, did any of those hit? Uh, I know I got a rope mischance. Oh, um, one of them might not. Hold on. Which number is this? Number eight. Uh, the 18 does hit because she charged. Okay. So the first attack. Um, you do have yeah the percentages. Does hit. Yep. Uh, there. The second attack. Um, there's still mirror images though. Oh, I thought she only had one. Oh, okay. Go and roll one d four. How many is she? Okay, so we'll just hold on to that 10 for a little bit, so there's now three images. Uh, that That's a miss. And a hit. So 1d3. That was the wrong die to use. Uh -huh. Okay. Another image. So now there's just two of her. All right, I'll take. Go. Actually, that ten didn't even. And then. Apply, so. Go ahead. I'll five foot step over here. Oh. And I'm done. All right, so she's unconscious, and then number one. Henrik, where are you going? Oh, he wants to follow me, even after that, that cool, refreshing spray. Yes. And she's going to swing her great sword at you twice, because she is okay. hasted. Let me go ahead and just turn that on. You guys can figure it out by now. So You just didn't see her cast it. Okay, one hits. Two hits. Don't read the images. Well, two possible hits. Yeah. So where are we at now with you on images? 1D8. 1D8. Okay, so one image down. Two images down. We will succeed at something. Debatable. Um, grappled. Okay, yeah. Casting didn't work. I get out of the grapple. Nope. Number five. She, oh yeah, she's fleeing because this, this is hard. Training dummies aren't quite the same. Number five is going to cast a spell. The giant plant. She's going to five foot step forward so she can get visual of her and cast a spell sending magic missiles at Amara. 
Not a plant, I'm an air elemental. Air elemental, I'm sorry. That's fair. Air elementals are... scary. I'm a cat-shaped air elemental. Oh yes, I forgot about that. However that works. Yeah. <laughs> and number seven is going to cast a spell. And if anybody wants to spellcraft this, it is kind of unique and not obvious. Henrik, you know she's casting True Strike. Okay. As she stays where she is. Okie dokie. Number eight. Next to Abysm. She's going to take her shot at you, Abysm, like without the true strike and see how it goes. Okay. Two swings because she's hasted. Oh, did I really hit with a 20? That should not have hit. That's... Hmm? What's your AC right now? Because my shield... My AC should be... At least 24. Oh, something's wrong here. My armor isn't input. One moment. Okay, so she missed with that attack. Yes. Okay, uh, then the other one misses. All right, well, that didn't work for her. She gave it her best shot, though. Um, however, she is going to five foot step down. Okay, and Henrik? All right, I'm going to try one of my new spells. Oh. I'm going to take a five foot step back. Great swords don't have reach, do they? And I'm going to begin casting. No. Nope. Do they? No, okay. They don't have reach either. Hmm. I'm going to start casting Shadow Evocation. Oh, okay. And I tell them, you really need to chill. And he opens his mouth wide, and he's going to use Shadow Evocation to mimic Dragon's Breath with a cold breath, a cone of 30-foot cold. Okay. So first, these two are going to make a will save, which I will press the button for. Uh, they both fail. Then to them, it looks like real dragon's breath. Now they make a reflex save. Uh, they both fail. They take the full 12d6. From a dragon damage. of Henrik. Yeah. This man turned into a dragon, I swear, and he breathed on me. Wow, but that did, did way more damage than my cone of cold. Look at those numbers. <laughs> yeah, no, they didn't live to tell the tale at all. Is it the same amount of dice? It's just you rolled better? No, it was less here? dice. There's less dice, just you just the, rolled these better? numbers are way better. Yeah, yeah look at them. Yeah, oh, Most of the threes. Sixes. Yeah. Hmm. Well, Henrik was thinking, wow, that spell is amazing. Thank you, <laughs> dead illusion guy. Dead illusion guy. <laughs> Alright, uh, Amar and Diana. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, maintaining the grapple. Uh, you dead yet? You dead. Um, and then let's move over 
here. And uh, Amar will five foot and attack number eight. Okay. Forget it has one image. You hit both times. You succeed. Okay, there's a hit. There goes the last image. Hooray! Go, Bism, I believe in you. Number three is dead. Nizzo. Okay. Uh. Does displacement work like. Um, dang, I don't think I actually even can sneak attack somebody with displacement, can I? They have concealment, you can't. Yeah. Um, it depends if you want right to go here. by the spirit or the words. <laughs> I know what's displacement with says. Can... Does it strictly give them display, uh, concealment, or does it just work like concealment? Displacement gives just says 50% miss chance. It doesn't say it gives them concealment, which is the really? rules lawyery oh, part really? of it. Oh. It says 50% miss chance as if it had total concealment. Oh, see, yes. There, there you go. <laughs> so, yeah, that makes sense. as if, though. <laughs> so, yeah, but it doesn't I can say see... it does. Oh, it works like concealment. Yeah, I could, see, I could see a rules lawyer argument to be made there. Um, but anyway. However, you can see them, so matters. they're not invisible, but true seeing will counter displacement. That's true, too, but I don't have true seeing. I'm just wondering it, about, like... Displacement has like, to I have don't... some edge over mirror. Yeah, some edge. Tiny bit, but, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, I don't think I'm going to do anything because, like, I, I can't do anything. <laughs> mm. So I just won't. I'll just hang out. I'll just hang out over here. Like, go hang out over here. Okay. Up, I'm invisible. Yeah, advantage. I was trying to get rid of the displacement so that you could sneak attack them. Yeah, because then I could just run up and be like, sneak attack with a acid splash and do a hilarious damage with acid splash, but that'll just have to wait for another time. All right, um, Abyssal. If I fit down and I'll attack. Okay, so I am going to quick draw my wand and use that with my wand ability. Get going okay. here any, soon anyway, so. Okay, so uh, she still has an image up or not? Um, no. Blah, 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 blah. You hit, no images, just displacement. Okay. Uh, that first one was with a true strike, so I ignore the displacement. Okay. And then the rest are just normal attacks. Yeah, I gotta get going, so. If you want to NPC me for the rest of this fight, that's fine. Okay. I probably won't really be much use with two people up with displacement up right now, so that's probably I probably don't have to have you do anything at all. I'll see you guys later. See you. See you. Uh, Bye. You hit. She's still alive.
And is that it? Well, that first one was a crit. No, it didn't crit. I pushed the wrong button, sorry. Um, no, that's right, 90, okay. So I, uh, I critical threatened, and it didn't confirm? Okay. No, you did, you did confirm. Um, so attack number two, I guess you can roll your crit damage with that, because you also hit through the crit. Okay, there we go, let me add that. Okay, so that's it. That's my that's my turn. Yeah. Okay, and then this one's unconscious. This one is dead. This one's unconscious. This one's dead. Round nine. This one's dead. Uh, number five. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. Um. Wow. Okay. Number five is going to cast a spell. But she stays where she is. Nobody spellcrafted it, so nobody knows. Uh, number seven is dead. Number eight. All right, she's hasty. She's going to take two swings at you, Abyssin. Okay. But first, she's going to five foot step down. Uh, I guess she hit. And the second attack. See, you're not broken on my end. I can still hit you. It's weird. I don't know how that's happening. Henrik? All right. I'm going to... I forgot that I had fly on myself. I can fly mm -hmm. over here. Yeah. And I'm going to wand this one. That's more hurt. Okay. My magic missile. Oh man, the one that's trying so hard to survive. Using up a lot of these charges. She's like the only They've been most disagreeable. Yeah. Honestly, they're not up for talking. Yeah, they don't seem like it. Yeah. And I take offense to that. Yeah. Diana and Amara? Uh, uh... You know what? Go ahead and walk through here, Diana. I believe in you. I believe. Okay, uh, she's going to take her attack of opportunity. Number eight? Number eight. And Who's five. That? Oh, and five? Okay. Oh, that actually hits, but not confirmed. Alright, she does some damage as Diana passes by, and five is... Uh, Um, unconscious. Oh, five's unconscious? She got missled down, apparently. Oh, then she would have gone here instead of all the way back there. But yeah. Okay. Uh, bite. Uh, there it is. You hit. No mirror images, no displacement. 
Uh, on this one, nope, nothing left. Uh, grapple. Okay. And I'll five foot step over here. Actually, I, yeah, whatever. And I'll smack it twice. So two hits. There we go. Diana will drop now. Huh? Are we out of combat? Yep. Yeah. Yay, room two. <laughs> Hooray. Now I'll go fight the boss. Alright. We'll do that. <laughs> cool. Loot. One thing at a time. Right Today? Too. No. Oh, well. Gosh, that was like two combat sessions. <laughs> Two combats that lasted five hours or something silly. Yeah, lots of little things will do that. This is one situation where I think troop rules would make it a lot better. Um... Well, we don't have a lot of AoE. I mean, if we were dropping like yes, fireballs and cones of colds and stuff, then we would be ignoring their mirror images and ignoring their uh, displacements and stuff. But troops are like 15 to 30 people, so that was the whole idea of a troop. Well, we fought like 20 of them. Uh, no, there was only 9 in this room, and then 6 in the other room of 6 in... I mean, total. Well, I guess, but... Well, you can have smaller troops, too. Uh, I sh I'm sure, but I think the troop design was for like a large quantity. They would I don't think it would be a troop anymore. Well, I mean, I guess you could still use because I I have I have Bestiary six and they have troops as small as ten things. Oh, okay, so they're starting to use that more. Like they present a. It's funny they present a uh, a a group a troop of Drow priestesses. That's uh. like ten or eleven of them. Lol. That I might throw at you guys in Second Darkness. Oh, thanks. Oh, God. Thank you. <laughs>